the number of newly registered electric vehicles, EVs, in Korea surpassed 100,000 units last year alone. Norway is the only other country to match such numbers. The core materials that determine the battery life and charging speed of now commonly seen EVs are anode materials. Korea's domestic battery industry has been committed to finding revolutionary ways to increase the battery capacity by introducing new technologies or other anode materials. But what if we get rid of anode materials altogether? A post-tech research team led by Professor Sujin Park and PhD candidate Sung Jin Cho, Department of Chemistry, in collaboration with Professor Dong Hua Seo and Dr. Dong Yian Kim, School of Energy and Chemical Engineering, at Ulsan Institute of Science and Technology, UNIST, have developed Anode Free L. The newly developed anode free battery has a volumetric energy density of 977 watt hours per liter, which is 40% higher than the conventional batteries, 700 WH, L. This means that the battery can run for 630 kilometers on a single charge. Batteries usually change the structure of anode materials as lithium ions flow to and from the electrode during repetitive charging and discharging. This is why the battery capacity decreases over time. It was thought that if it was possible to charge and discharge only with a bare anode current collector without anode materials, the energy density, which determines the battery capacity, would increase. However, this method had a critical weakness which causes significant swelling of the anode volume and reduces the battery life cycle. It swelled because there was no stable storage for lithium in the anode. To overcome this issue, the research team succeeded in developing an anode-free battery in a commonly used carbonate-based liquid electrolyte by adding an ion-conductive substrate. The substrate not only forms an anode protective layer but also helps minimize the bulk expansion of the anode. The study shows that the battery maintained high capacity of 4. 2 milliamp hours CM2 and high current density of 2. 1 milliamp per CM2 for a long period in the carbonate-based liquid electrolyte. It was also proven both in theory and through experiments that substrates can store lithium. Further, what's drawing even more attention is that the team successfully demonstrated the solid-state half-cells by using argyrodite-based sulfide-based solid electrolyte. It is anticipated that this battery will accelerate the commercialization of non-explosive batteries since it maintains high capacity for longer periods. The study recently published in Advanced Functional Materials was funded by the Alchemist Project. Make a difference. Sponsored Opportunity Story Source. Materials provided by Pohang University of Science Technology, Postec. Note. Content may be edited for style and length. Journal reference. Sung Jin Cho, Dong Yian Kim, Yung In Lee, Jisoo Kong, Pyongsook Lee, Gahyun Kim, Dong Hua Seo, Su Jin Park. Highly reversible lithium host materials for high energy density anode free lithium metal batteries. Advanced Functional Materials, 2022, 2208629 DOI, 10. 1002, ADFM. 202208629 Cite this page. Pohang University of Science Technology, Postec. The battery that runs 630 kilometers on a single charge. Science Daily. Science Daily, 6 October 2022. ift.tt/u0ymas. Pohang University of Science Technology, Postec.
2022, October 6. The battery that runs 630 kilometers on a single charge. Science Daily. Retrieved October 6, 2022 from ift.tt U0 YMAS Pohang University of Science Technology, Postec. The battery that runs 630 kilometers on a single charge. Science Daily. ift.tt U0 YMAS, accessed October 6, 2022. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe my channel for more videos.